What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have a new mail day with a lot of exciting things. We have some new pickups here, one that I spent a lot on that came damaged, so we'll go through that whole process in a second. And then we'll also have uh, this package from Panini's customer service. We have some new supplies here I finally got in for the first time, as well as a new repack. We have a recap of some boxes, baseball that I opened off camera, which is really quick. And I have another big surprise, literally a big surprise, so I'll give you a little sneak peek now. So you can kind of see it there. And I'll have that at the end of the video. So it's kind of these giant oversized cards and uh, some are autographed too. So definitely worth taking a look at. And I'll be giving some away in the uh, not too far future. So yeah, stay tuned to the end of the video. I'll have a little look at some special oversized cards uh, or I guess card art that are made by a local shop near me. So that being said, let's get into our mail day here. If you guys like these videos, you like mail days and want to see more kind of stuff like this or stuff not like this, show support in these vids, like the video if you have not, and then subscribe to the channel, especially if you are new. You can also sign up for membership, help support the channel, get some bonus content. The link is down below in the description. And um, yeah, appreciate all you guys as always. So we also have tons of giveaways going on, some singles, a box, big stuff, a lot of things. Check the information in the description. You'll see where it says giveaway and you can enter win some prizes to so make sure you like the video, subscribe and follow me on whatnot and join our live stream when it's time. All the information down below uh, to be entered. A lot of awesome prizes. Try your luck. Many, many winners. So we'll start with our singles here first and I have this stack here. So I'm just gonna go through kind of one by one, show you guys what we got and uh, guess the story with it. So start here. First, we have some stickers, got some sticker packs and I got this nice ice, nice ice shea. So there you go. Now these stickers come with cards and they've been coming with cards for a year or two now, something like that. So nice ice shea there. Then we have some other ones and stickers are cool. Nothing insane here really, but got some all-star stuff. And uh, yeah, those are stickers. Then we also get cards. We have this Wiggins here. And here's the cool one. Got a Giddy rookie. So you haven't seen his sticker rookie. There it is. Very cool card. And yeah, I like these. They're nice little bonuses with the sticker packs. So you see stickers, you can get a card with those. So there we go. Got some Grizzlies action here as well. And as always, I don't know who does and doesn't want to be mentioned, but appreciate everyone who made a deal with me or sent stuff in. Got some Bane, some Jaren, some Jaren, some Jaren. Jaren, very nice card. Love Jaren's Prism. And then we got Brandon Clark. Awesome flawless action. One of 25, very interesting. Very, very cool. Love these. Got that game worn action on the back there. So huge dub. Love these. And those are some of the single pickups. So move this to the side here. Then we also have these here. So just a recap of some of the uh, box I opened off camera with this pack band. We do baseball, but it's off camera usually. So um, yeah, I got these here and two boxes of Heritage. I always rip Heritage. Long time ago, we pulled the Juan Soto Superfractor Rookie. So love Heritage. Got Glaber, my Yankees. Got a Bellinger. This is the image variation there. Got the uh, black there, Glacius, and then Wander Franco. Miss Pack pulled the Franco. So out of two boxes, we were able to get one. Then got Carrera there, and that's uh, another just two color, just two color there. And then got this one from our Yankees, Luis Heel. Very cool. 273. So I'll take it for sure. Cool card. And uh, yeah, how we do. Is there anyone else we should be looking for rookie wise? We got Wander, got Duran there, but um, yeah, anyone else? I don't know. We kind of opened it just for fun, and uh, that's what we got. So we got some more stuff, too, that didn't feel like including. I didn't think it was anything too crazy. But if there's anyone else we should look for, let me know. Now for these singles here. All right, first up is this one. If I can get it up. Yeah, there we go. All right. So we have Prism. Desmond Bain. Is it numbered? It is. It's 25 of 25. Very nice card. Contenders Optic. There we go. Got that little itty-bitty auto down there. Desmond Bain, one of my faves, 22, favorite number, Rudy's number, my favorite player, and now Bain, of all people, gets the number. Couldn't be happier. So, nice card. Does have a little bit of a corner ding up there, but um, overall, it's a nice card, and I knew that before I bought it, so uh, we took that into account. But, yeah, nice card. Orange from Contenders Optic, and uh, made a play for this one. Very happy for my collection. Another Bane, and many more to go, of course. So, if you ever have any big Banes, feel free to hit me up. Might be interested. So, there we go. Nice one there. And let's put this to the side. And then here is our big card that came damaged. So all the story and everything with that. So let's see what we got here. Got it in a mag. And there we go. Older design. Bucks. It's Jabari Parker. No, it's Giannis. I love Jabari Parker. One of my faves. But Giannis there. 86 of 99. And see the year. 
There we go. Giannis, Silhouettes RPA. Love these ones. Now I'll show you where it's damaged in just a second and kind of tell you the whole story with this one. So love these silhouettes. In the background we have AD silhouettes and we also have a Giannis that you can't see but it's in the back there. And um, yeah, love this line. It's been around for a while. It's a popular one on card and um, nice jumbo swatch there, jersey, relic, whatever you want to call it. And um, yeah, so got this one and uh, paid over three for it now. When I got it, I realized it was damaged here. I took a look at the card and uh, in the pictures, you couldn't see this. And it's kind of tough to see here, but I'll try to get you the best angle I can. There's a sleeve in front of it, but you can see at the top there. Notice how you see that. Can't get the best angle, but there's a kind of a, I don't know, maybe half an inch, inch, somewhere between there, kind of indent in the card. I'm trying to get a better angle. And there's a scratch, kind of like, um, I don't know, like a mini rake just kind of went across it. It's very tough to see like this, but you can kind of make it out. So I noticed that. Oh, there you go. There you go. That's a better angle. It's like, imagine like a tiny, if a, if a mouse had a rake, it's a really weird way to say it, but yeah. And then there's like a giant, like someone took their fingernail and that for like 10 seconds. So I noticed that now in certain situations, uh, you can obviously contact the seller and you can ask for a refund. You can return it or something like that. In this case, uh, one thing I inquired about was maybe a partial refund. I really wanted the card and, um, he was absolutely down to, so we worked out a deal and uh, I was partially refunded and I kept the card and I kept the remainder of the money, of course. So that's one option I uh, noticed and one thing that I would sometimes recommend to you guys, if you guys really like the card and it comes damaged or there's an issue, sometimes try to work something out with the seller. And um, it was a you know, pleasant exchange. We were able to work something out. I was glad I was able to keep this card and um, he still got what I believe is a very fair price for this card. So there we are. Nice one there. And if you have any similar experiences, do let me know. So it's a pretty deep kind of scratch or indent there and then that scratch right above it which is um decent size there too so notice that and thank you to the seller we were able to work something out um pleasant experience overall so keep that in mind if you ever have a situation like this that's something to consider definitely a, a nice option there um of course there's also returning there's things like that so another option that i decided to explore this time and it worked out for both of us so thank you to the seller and um nice card for the collection love you honest awesome player awesome guy and you're rooting for him. Hopefully he does very well. Nice new Giannis for the collection. And hopefully we can pick up some more students. So there we go. I'll put this to the side now. And real quick before we get into this interesting uh, replacement here. I pulled this Mac not too long ago. And I got a booklet mag for it. So this is like 25 bucks. If you're wondering how to protect these. Got this. And not often do you have trifold booklets. Booklets themselves are pretty rare. Let alone a trifold one. But we have a trifold booklet here. And uh, it's, a, it's a cool card tough to protect so this is like 25 bucks something like that the fit isn't perfect i have some sleeves in front so the surface doesn't scratch you can see there's some space here like uh maybe i don't know half a centimeter or something like that uh, maybe a little less than that but yeah so it does kind of move around a bit in here but there's really nothing else i can think of that would really protect this card so went with this finally came in and uh put it together and there you go mac jones in this nice black uh booklet you can choose the colors too so if you have one of these there are protectors out there uh, there's also ones for just a kind of double panel booklet, which are much easily available compared to, or more easily available compared to these ones. So yeah, what do you guys think? Love the card and uh, one of our many Mac Joneses. If you haven't seen any of our recent videos, definitely check them out. Almost every single one has a big Mac Jones poll or a big uh, hit of some sort. We've been doing really well, thankfully. So definitely check it out. Pulling a lot of fire recently and uh, doing a lot of cool videos. So Pac Madness, Football versus Basketball, new reviews. Definitely give it a look, but there we go. And now for... Panini's customer service package. All right. So let's get this out of here. I do know what this card is. And here we go. So situation, we have a different card as a replacement for the original card. Let me show you guys. Once again, don't forget to uh, just point these vids with a like. Let me see which side's the front. Like, sub, and membership, something like that. And enter our giveaways. A lot of prizes being given away. Try your luck. A lot of good stuff. Definitely check the description out just for a second and maybe you'll see some stuff you're interested in. So here we go. This is a card that I don't believe I've had before. I don't think, maybe I've had one before. And if I did, I don't remember it, but these are not easy to pull. So here's the card. Jalen Hurts. All right. And let's see. All right. There we go. So these are the XRCs and these are from Select. Now, I like select basketball a lot, but select basketball really could be much better. Select football is excellent. And they have these XRCs, they have chunky RPAs, 
all sorts of good stuff that basketball does not have, which is why I kind of uh, sometimes are harsh on select basketball. But these are awesome. They're not the easiest to pull, especially for the quarterbacks. But we got this Jalen Hurts here, and this was a replacement for a Kareem uh, Hunt autograph. So um, yeah, I got this one in. It's a nice card for sure. And uh, yeah, after a while, if they don't have the replacement for the card, then they uh, send you a different card of, I guess, equal value. And um, it's an interesting one to get, an XRC. Not often uh, have I seen too many of these. I think I've maybe pulled one. I really don't know if I did. If I did, it wasn't anything huge, but these are very popular cards and uh, some of the first kind of rookies you can get. And um, yeah, just cool stuff. So these come in redemption form from Select and they're very nice. So if you're a Hertz fan, this is definitely a card you probably want to have for your collection. But there you go. The design for these also looks really sick. Love these compared to some of the other ones. So what are your thoughts? XRCs, awesome cards. Please add them for basketball. And yeah, those are my thoughts there. So cool replacement from Panini's customer service in the case that my initial card was not available to be replaced. So there we go. What are your thoughts? Put this to the side here. All right. And second to last thing before we get into our big surprise, and now I'll move this off screen here. We'll put it right here. We have Fan Crate. This is drop number two, and I have this little piece of paper here. So drop two features one authenticated signed baseball and one superstar relic or autographed relic here. It's 165. I wrote that myself on there. It's 165. Links down below. Tried the first one. It was really cool. Check out our uh, past mail days if you want to see more stuff like this. And drop one, which is awesome. We pulled an amazing card from that. And uh, here's drop two. Let's see what's going on. Got a baseball orientation this time. So let's move this to the side. And let's see what's going on. Let's see if it's hot or if it's not. What you guys think? As always, comment your thoughts down below. What do you think of it? So let's get this opened. And there we are. All right. So let me see what this is looking like. A big piece of foam on top. Oh, there's, all right, here's the card first. Let's get the card. There's our baseball right there. Can't make out who it is though. All right, so here's our relic card. Rick Maddox there, pretty nice. And uh, to 300, so definitely a baseball oriented once again this time. And we got a piece of a bat there. I like these, baseball's got some of the cooler relics. So 236 of 300, very nice one. And there we go. All right, we'll put that there. And here's our baseball. This is definitely the, uh, the big one here. So let's see, let's get this up. All right, how am I gonna get this out? I'm not sure, it's not really budging. I guess that's good protection wise. All right, here we go. Here's our baseball, a nice little holder there. All right. I assume it's signed like right here. See the authentication. Okay. Let's see who it is. Oh, all right. Nice and careful with this. Here we go. All right. I don't know who the autograph that is. I'm not a baseball expert and I don't know if it says it on here. Does it say on here? Uh, all right. I guess I'll have to check. I'll put a little thing down below uh, for who this is, but yeah, cool. Autographed baseball and little pieces of stuff all over it from this, this box here. So that's on the outside. Yeah. We'll have to give this a, a clean after because this thing got a torn to shreds pulling this out, but cool. Signed baseball and authenticated. So we'll take a look at this and uh, yeah, it's a cool piece. So if you're interested for yourself, links down below, definitely baseball theme kind of this time. So fun overall. And I did like the last one. If you got them for yourself, let me know what you got. But that being said, let's get into our big surprise. All right, guys, so here's the big surprise we have, and it's literally a big surprise. These are oversized cards or posters or card arts, whatever you want to call them. These are made by a local card shop not too far from me uh, called Wild Sports Cards. So they actually provided some to be given away to you guys. So stay tuned for one of these involved in a giveaway. I love doing giveaways for you guys, and I'll have many more, so stay tuned. There's also basketball, and we have a signed version too, so I'll show you guys. And uh, I guess you can pick which one you want to see in the giveaway. But yeah, so here's a Burrow. You got the Cracked Ice, the Rookie. It's a die cut too, so really creative here. And um, yeah, it's just really awesome stuff. Nice gold Burrow there, very popular player. So they can do this with pretty much any card, I think. So if they have maybe a Jordan Rookie or they have uh, a Zion or Ja, something like that. So really awesome. And uh, yeah, really like these pieces here. So here's the first one. And then let me get the second one for you guys. Here's basketball. We have Luca. This is Prism Gold. Got the ice once again. I imagine you can get them signed like right here, 
and hang it up on your wall next to some signed jerseys, card pieces, stuff like that. Just really awesome stuff that goes very well with what we do. So uh, Luca there. And um, yeah, maybe we'll see some other kind of cards they add to their little portfolio of designs, but really nice stuff. And a big fan of this one here. So next up is a signed version, Orange Taylor. So one of the best to ever do it, PSA authenticated. And there we go, autograph right on the piece. So beautiful, beautiful die cut there that we see from Select. And uh, yeah, just really awesome stuff here. So if you had to pick one of these you've seen so far, which one would it be? Finally, this is a Zebra Mahomes. So really awesome card. Got that Zebra pattern once again, die cut. And yeah, Patrick Mahomes, one of the most popular players, one of the best players. So really awesome pieces. What are some cards you'd want to see on one of these? And out of the four you saw, which one would you want in the giveaway? So beautiful stuff. And that's it for this mail day, guys. We'll have many more soon. If you want to see more, show support these vids. We'll have many, many more. And thank you to everyone who uh, made this mail day possible. So last four stars once again. Uh, thank you to everyone who sent stuff in. And uh, we got to review the new repack. And we also saw that card, which came with some unexpected damage. And thankfully, uh, with the seller's help, we were able to come to a deal that we both were happy with. So much love to them. Thank you, everyone. And we'll have many more soon. So that being said, thank you guys for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.